I've been involved in conservation for 30 years, and I feel like we have been losing this battle because we as a society have never really invested enough media resources to help the world understand why it is imperative to save nature today. Well, one thing that I realized as a scientist is that there were a lot of people that didn't know what was so precious on the planet. Of course, photography is a key part of what we have as tools to convince people to think. The beauty of photography is it has that visceral power in a moment. In a moment, it conveys a story, it creates emotion, it causes a reaction in the heart. And, you know, it, words can't do it like that, not as quickly. For el planeta. In English, it means for the planet. And that's literally what it is. It's an effort on behalf of our planet. Por el planeta is a conservation photography um, contest that the whole world is going to be able to be involved. But it's about photography and it's about conservation. The actual contest begins on January 5th and it extends to March 27th. And it's happening worldwide, all over the world. And it is hopefully going to be the most successful, largest conservation photography competition ever in our history. Now more than ever, we have to try to look at how do we preserve habitats and places for the other creatures that we share this planet with. Um, we're going through something now that people call the sixth extinction. That's how rapidly we're losing um, species. We, our planet is not well. We are at a time of serious judgment day about what we're gonna do to save our planet, to protect our planet, to, to drive conversations and drive people's behaviors and make them see the light of what's in front of them. And that's only gonna happen through conservation and storytelling photography. We do not need another pretty picture photo contest. When you have uh, three powerful forces, one of them being the government of Mexico, another one, uh, the most important media corporation in Mexico, Televisa, and then National Geographic, which is a global brand that has a history of 125 years of exploration and conservation. I think it provides a competition like Por el Planeta, which has as its main central theme, conservation with real gravitas and real importance. I think it's impossible to ignore. It's important for National Geographic to be involved in Poplanenta because uh, we share the same values. We have the same commitment to telling the truth, to giving a voice to places, to animals, to people who often don't have a voice. I believe that it's not only a photo contest. It is a movement because obviously you have or you need National Geographic of Televisa to organize this. But at the end of the day, it's a movement of people who are really worried about changing the planet that we have now. The most beautiful stories are often right in front of your nose and it doesn't cost you any money and you can do it every day after school, you can do it on the weekends, you can do it in the evening, maybe you're gonna do star trails over Mexico City. These stories, stories are, I used to think, all the stories have been done. We haven't scratched the surface of, of the stories that need to be told. Stories are all around us and they're more important than ever considering the conservation challenges we have ahead of us. There is still a lot of magic left in the world, and there are ways that we can work together to save it. And to have a contest that not only, they charge you a tiniest amount, tiniest fee possible to enter, and then take that money now and give it to important conservation projects. That's another step that nobody else has done. When we accounted for all the money that's gonna be awarded, the prices come up to about 300,000 US dollars. The main prize, the prize for the winning image, is 100,000 US dollars, which is the largest prize awarded by any competition. It's that important. The prize money is fantastic, and I applaud it completely because it gets people's attention. But the real beauty of the contest is what it does for our souls. I think the idea of making this competition about conservation photography is what sets it apart. And I think we're gonna see a lot of entries from very passionate people who are documenting things that they really care about. And uh, hopefully, together we can start changing the way we see our planet.